My apologies for not bringing you guys an epic intro to my best class setup video. I always try to get like a nice little intro. Just throw it in there, you know. But um, I'm actually running late on a few things today. And I, I'm i just a scrub. I couldn't bring you guys an intro. I apologize. I couldn't bring you guys, in quotation marks, an epic intro, in other words. Uh, but what's going on, guys? My name is Hollow, and thanks for tuning back into the channel. Today, I got a best class setup video for you guys. Call of Duty Black Ops 3, best Weevil class setup. Um, we're going to be taking a look at the SMG and what I basically like to use. There's a few alternatives that you guys can do with this best class setup obviously like i always tell you guys these best class setup videos are completely 100 customizable you guys just get a base foundation for me and then you guys can somewhat tweak them however you guys like it so um obviously looking to the primary weapon here we have the weevil looking into the optics and attachments we don't have any optics i really like the iron sights in the weevil um they're pretty damn clear i'm not gonna lie and then the attachments we got the grip for reduced recoil while aiming down the sight and shooting and then quick draw to aim faster down the sight now i know there's a few attachments that you actually could put on this weevil you could put the extended mags which actually gives you 70 bullets per clip which is freaking insane i think the 50 i think it gives you 50 or 40 i'm pretty sure it's 50 uh regularly which is absolutely crazy i think that's so op uh but don't say nothing and they, they probably won't nerf it so if you guys are playing like an objective based game mode then you could probably go ahead and go for the extended mags that way you guys don't have to reload that much if you encounter like an entire team you could probably take all of them out if you're a damn boss if not then uh then things could be a little bit different um you can also go ahead and run the long barrel but i feel like long barrel it's really not a necessity unless you kind of camp with an smg which really makes no sense the smgs are meant to rush and kind of get in their face um, so that's why i think quick draw and grip are probably the best bet and of course objective game modes maybe extended max i like quick draw and grip you know you really really don't need to camp with an smg it's just not very practical um, so anyways, enough of that. I'm uh, moving on into the secondaries here. We have the RK5 best pistol in the game um, It's gonna complement you once you go down into the perks here, which uh, that's what we're gonna do right now So lethals and tacticals we got nothing there the perks um, as you guys can see I run six cents a lot in my perks and you know for my class setups because I think six cents is the best perk one in the entire game now for a second I did think that the perk ghost would actually hide you from six cents But it doesn't say it does all it does is hide you from UAVs while moving and planting or diffusing bombs or controlling score streaks Aside from that, it does not, you know, hide you from six cents. So that's why I think six cents is probably better than ghost. So I wrote six cents and then fast hands for the perk two swap weapons faster for the RK5 and aim faster after sprinting because we do have an SMG and most likely we're gonna be sprinting a lot of the time. Moving down into the perk threes, we have awareness and I just love these two perks together here, man. Awareness and dead silence. Enemy movements are easier to hear with awareness and dead silence. You basically uh, move silently. Now, if you guys like, I always say, if you don't have headsets, put on tactical mask or blast suppressor i think tactical mask is actually better than blast suppressor for once uh this game the stuns are really really op and getting stunned basically means you're dead so if you guys have tactical mask you will most likely not encounter that frustration of getting stunned and then getting killed afterwards so if you guys have a headset always run awareness and dead silence especially like if you're playing free for all it's really really helpful if not run you know tactical mask and dead silence or tactical mask and blast suppressor all up to you guys can practically experiment with those two and and just see how it works better for you guys so this is my weevil best class setup video let me know in the comments if you guys like this class setup if you guys use it in any other way shape or form let me know down in the comments if you guys can help this video by dropping a thumbs up if we can smash 350 likes on this video guys i would really appreciate it thank you all so much for tuning back into the channel let me know down in the comments what weapon you guys want to see next i'll catch you guys in the next video